am here with executive producer Victoria Alonso, and we were just talking about the amazingness of Taiko Atiti. We are so blessed to have his talent, his joy, and his never-ending energy to bring another Thor to the world. How exciting is that, right? I mean, we started, I know, Thor 4. It, that's a hard one to say, Thor 4, especially for a foreigner. <laughs> I was trying to start a four for Thor chant, and then I realized how hard it is to say four for Thor for blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Thor for Thor. That no, that would be a big yeah. That would be a, a difficult one. Yeah. No, but it's super exciting to have him and the mighty Thor. So we have uh, Miss Portman as well, which is uh, again another privilege. I have to ask you about the origin of the origin story of how you all decided that this was the right time for the mighty Thor and bringing in this story from the comics. Well. We, we have a, um, a trajectory where we have our regular Thor, our Thor, and then uh, as you can see when you go see the movie, I'm not going to give you a lot of details because you're, otherwise you're not going to go see it, and I expect you all to see it at least four times, that um, it makes absolute sense how to get her there and in this love story to make sure that the mighty of the two of them could unite. It's really beautiful. And it's really funny. And there's this beautiful relationship between Valkyrie and this beautiful friendship. Can you talk about bringing that to the screen without spoilers? I think it's a, you know, it's a true buddy. It, they're buddies. I mean, Thor and Valkyrie are buddies and she's doing the job that he said, I don't want to do, please be king and take it over. And I think that throughout, um, throughout their time together, they learn about each other, and they not only do they learn about how to meander through this world, but also to be friends, to be true friends and support one another. And that's one of the joys of watching this film, watching all the friendships over time. Thor has been on such a journey, and this film has been on a technological journey. Can you give us insight into working with the volume and what that production process was like? You know, every, every year we get some new development in technology, and I think having the volume and having it's, to be honest with you, for the actors is so important because all of a sudden they don't walk into a green screen world, they walk into perhaps the world that it would, or, or if it's not partial, is full of the world that they're going to be living. So it's super helpful to the characters. And, uh, you know, it's new technology, so there's a lot to do, a lot to learn about it. I always have all kinds of criticism, as people know. <laughs> to make it better so we can do it to make it better well that's your job thank you for pushing the envelope all the time and such a joy to always talk to you thanks for talking to the fans I just want to say to all the fans out there thank you for your support COVID is not over but we're getting better so thank you and every format is available so please go see it in any format all over the world thank you 2d 3d 4d 4 Thor for all of them for, 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 for Thor, all of them. All right, have a great time tonight. Enjoy the movie. Thank you.